What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to show you the best IPTV APK that I've seen. If you're a STB user, this is a must-see video. If you're not familiar with IPTV, I'll get you pointed in the right direction. Stick around. Welcome back to Kelly Tech. Real quick, for people that don't know much about IPTV, my best advice would be do your research. So something that helped me was Reddit. I'll leave the URL in the description below. This page pretty much best practices before you buy. Once you've read that, click here. And you just got to go through and find one that fits your criteria. Like this post, if you don't want to spend a lot of money. This is a cheaper services. You can go through, read comments. And this one was pretty good also. Winners and losers of IPTV providers. You click there. If you, don't mint, uh, if you don't mind spending a little bit more, go through here, read the reviews. So you got to do the research and pick one. Once you've done that, once you bought one, most of them send you an email with information on how to log in to your service through a web browser of some sort. Once inside, you need two URLs. You need an M3U playlist URL and an EPG URL. Now that we're done with that, let's get to the good part. I'm going to switch over to the shield. All right, go to your Play Store. And I was just searching the other day and found this gem. Like, I love this app, it's great. TV mate. Well, it's spelt funny, but there it is. Love this app. Install it. It's really simple to set up, too. There's not much to it. Open it up. And you only got one option, add playlist. And you're going to want to enter your URL. And this is your uh, M3U URL. So I'm going to enter that real quick. Once you have your URL entered, go to next. And if all is well, it'll go forward. If it gives you an error, you typed in something wrong. So hit next. Yep, worked. So go to done. All right, so now we got our channels. Let's go to the settings cog. I'm going to have to go through and uh, set up each one of these. Just take a minute. We already did the playlist. TV guide. TV guide source. And add a source. Now you have to enter your EPG URL. And I'm going to do that real quick. And once you have entered your EPG URL, hit OK. Back on out of here. You have to have the paid version to do this, but I'm going to put it on one day.
turn a couple things on. Update the TV guide. Grow appearance. Looks good in there. I like to turn this on because it actually tells you the resolution instead of just saying HD. Playback. You can auto start on boot. I like this. Hit back twice to exit. I like to use an external player. And that's pretty much it. And here it is. Nice smooth interface. I love this. This APK is amazing. This is a cheaper service that I have on here. And it didn't run all that great. But with this program, it runs wonderful. I haven't had it freeze on me. Nothing. It runs great ever since I switched over to this. I had it on a set top box emulator and this is way better but you know you got your sections it's just so simple you even have well you got adult but you got your, your VOD too which, which is sweet it's just so simple there's really no way to get confused on this app it looks a lot like cable. You can add favorites. Yeah, I can't say enough good things about this. Uh, let's find a channel real quick. Dateline. Now to sleep better every night. Order your sheets performance sheet. Looks beautiful. Size and color. For a limited time, you'll get 25% off when you use And that was actually a slow load. Like this thing's pretty quick. No cost. That's a total savings of up to 100. Yeah. Love this. <laughs> well, I hope you guys try this app out cuz it is sweet. Compared to the other ones I've tried, I I do prefer to have like a little window with, with whatever's playing in the top right corner, but I guess you can't get everything you want because it is smooth. Well, guys, hope that helped you guys out. If it did, like and subscribe, and as always, have a tech day.